Today, I'm going to teach you about the Oculink and USB 4.0 interfaces. What is the boot sequence for connecting a graphics card dock? This time, I'm using the GameTech ADGP1 graphics card dock. It features the RX 760 MXT graphics card. Also, I have the K11 Mini PC with an Oculink interface and a handheld device with a USB 4.0 interface. First, plug in the graphics card dock to power. Use the external cable of the graphics card dock to connect to the Oculink interface of the host. Then, press the power button on the host. Note, the Oculink interface does not support hot swapping. So, make sure to connect and disconnect when the power is off. Connecting or disconnecting when the power is on may damage the motherboard. Next, enter the boot page. On the desktop control panel, open the device manager. Then, under display adapters, you should be able to see the RX 760 MXT display. This means the ADGP1 graphics card dock is connected. For AMD devices, no driver is required for a graphics card dock. For Intel devices, drivers need to be downloaded and installed. Next, let's connect the handheld device. First, plug in the graphics card dock to power. Then, use a USB-C cable to connect both the ADGP1 and the handheld device. Next, press the power button on the handheld. The USB 4.0 interface supports hot swapping, but it is still recommended to connect and disconnect with the power off. Note, only devices that support PD power delivery can provide power. It supports up to 1 West USB PD power delivery, saving you the need for an additional device power supply. Similarly, after entering the boot page, follow the same steps as with the Oculink interface to connect the mini PC. So, how is it? Did you learn it?